Okay. Uh, again, VMware View 5 setup. Uh, we're going to set up and install Composer. And again, uh, let's get started. The first thing we want to do is set up the database. So we're going to go to SQL uh, Server Management Studio. And uh, we're going to connect. And uh, again, we want to look for the databases folder. And we'll expand it a little. All right, you can see the vCenter. So right next to it, we're going to do a uh, new database. And the database we'll call, obviously, uh, View Composer 5. And just say OK. And again, now we got vCenter and the uh, view composer the two databases so uh, we'll minimize this and uh, as an fyi we want to do run as administrator on this one because when you come with the odbc setup um, it's going to give you an error so you got to run it as a, a sysadmin and again we're installing uh, Composer 2.7 and again this is the unpolished version of uh, YouTube instructs on setting up a VMware View 5 and this video is roughly about seven minutes um, probably going to let it play through the whole thing. I'm not going to do any um, edits. Uh, the Composer install is usually quite uh, simple and quick. This might be the longest part for it to initialize the the program in order to do the install. And now we're not locked up, it's just takes a couple of minutes. <clears throat> for it to kick off there we go so we're going to say next again next set the EULA and that's what I was talking about this is why you want to run it as um, as an administrator because you would get an error at this part so in this case we want to go uh, system DSN add SQL server uh, the name is going to be view composer 5 it's the name of the database description I'll just give it something obvious and again the name of the server is Q&A VC the virtual center then we can use the fault here you can check this and select the view composer fire database and finish test data okay we got communication so okay Okay. And then here we're just typing view composer five username. And 
password. And again, and install. And again, this is one of the uh, faster installs. Um, that's why, again, in order of precedence, um, the SQL Server, to me, again, that's always the, uh, the long part of the uh, install. Then the vCenter, but Compose is quite simple. Okay. Close this out. I'm gonna close this out. And uh probably gonna just bring up the control panel and illustrate that um composer is installed. And the control panel programs and All right, there we go. You compose it. All right, so again, you can see um, pretty much this concludes the installation of uh, eCenter with uh, the installation of Composer. Thanks for your time.